Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Nineties here. Today, I'm going to be doing a tour of my entire Gotham City, starting with the North End. So, here is Amusement Mile. It looks like crap, I know that. I'm just going, I'm waiting until I have enough money to get, or until I... I'm able to get a dark or a big forty eight by forty eight base plate and I'm gonna design an entire amusement mile using this stuff. I have this little sign here. I I, I custom made this. I'll I'll just print a amusement mile logo, put it on here. Little Lazarus Pit. So that's there. Over here, you have the Iceberg Lounge. It's a little helicopter scene with the Scarecrow. And the GCPD helicopter. You have Penguin's uh, Arctic Roller. Let's put it here because it goes well. Since it's the uh, Iceberg Lounge, you might as well have his Arctic Roller. Over here, you have... Archie Goodwin's or Archie Goodwin's uh, National Airport. This technically isn't located inside Gotham City. It's like outside since Gotham City is a uh, uh, island. It's located. It's located uh, outside of the city, so that it's easily accessible to anyone else. But I decided to keep it in the city because can't really I don't have enough room because it kind of takes up that space and then you can't walk there so you can't really do that here's the airport itself it's just where the planes are they're kind of cramped so you know if you're trying to take off you kind of run into there but you know it's fine it's Lego you can do whatever you want here you have Gotham Merchants Bank it's just the Official Lego bank from the 2017 or 16 uh, police city police line. I just put it down here and tile. I like to tile everything, at least everything I can. So most of the sidewalks or all of the sidewalks are tiled. See, like there, over there, there. They're, they might not be, like, fully smooth like this is, but it's tiled enough that it gets the point across. There's going to be, like, studs stuck sticking out. So, yeah. Here you have Wayne Tower on top. You can kind of see if I take this off correctly. There's Bruce Wayne. So, I can review this in a separate video. Here's just a convenience store gas station. With a little rant leading up to it down here. It's a little shopping cart for the custom grocery store. If I take that off there. Oh, there's a little weird thing. So, yeah. Um, you've got Luigi's Pizzeria with the apartment on top. I reviewed this in a separate video, so if you guys want to go see it, you can. It's just a cop shooting up Firefly, so. There is a uh, little kiosk here for a policeman. So I've, this thing comes up. I can show you. It doesn't really need its own video. I can show it here. So you got a little window back here. And a little doors that come out I just knocked the crane down but if I show it from here there the policeman is he can like it's kind of like one of those border control since there's this little gate here you, you, it's a it's Gotham City so you kind of want to keep it secure there's this little bike that can come out it's kind of out of focus because I'm reaching over. 
has the crane and knocked down. So here is a uh, Gotham Royal Hotel. It just looks like it, kind of, from Arkham Origins. So I was like, okay, I'll make it that, I guess. Here's Arkham Asylum. It's just a bunch of official sets put together, plus an extra custom module from the newer Arkham Asylum. Of course, that thing has to come off. Everything has to come off in a video, huh? It's not tiled inside, because that takes a lot of tiles. This is tile outside, and that's just to count for that uh, Arkham transport ve vehicle. Over there is is chemicals. I can probably make a short uh, video reviewing it, but it's it's from Lego Batman Two, the uh, extra level where you're trying to collect a million studs. So I I kind of paused the game and took a picture of it. And then took each piece besides this A because Lego games don't really respect the laws of Lego. Uh, I just made the ace sign. This little thing up here. It's all modular, so that can be taken off if you want to put something in. But I don't feel like putting anything in it because I don't know what to put in it. Here you have a, a little canister he's pouring or he's taking something from it or pouring it into there there's a little railing around you see here is a little canister this is n2o technically that's i think it'd be a positive uh molecule so it doesn't it's not really it's, it's reactive because it's it's positively charged. Doesn't really make sense. Nitrogen has three hole. Three, it needs three electrons. Well, oxygen needs two. So you're left with like four four holes. So yeah, it'd, it'd be. I'm trying to do the chemical equation in my, my head. It doesn't make sense. Chemical formula equation. Here you got this little chemical looking module thing i don't know i just took some tubes like this thing can be pumped up it's from an old pneumatic system it, i just put something together because it looked cool here you have this tube running from it it's, it's kind of like you pour the chemicals in here and then they're stored here you have a little octan uh canister there this is a little windshield piece that this thing rests on. Here is a little uh, kiosk area for people who want to park for the bus station to come in. Or if they want to get to here, the hotel. Yeah, so it's... There's the uh, bus station. Here I have Gotham Cathedral. This will definitely get its own review. This is one of my better mocks. Looks like something an A-Fall would make. I'm at T-Fall, so, you know. This is my custom GCPD. I've already made a review video on it. If you guys want to go check it out. I, I kind of just made it. So, there's a lot to it. It's all tiled the outside so yeah here is gotham general it's this it's just the official uh hospital lego set i just put it there it's also it's, it's probably one of my favorite city sets because it's modular but it's still open on the back side so you can still access it and it comes with a lot of stuff so for only 100 bucks i thought it was pretty great here is fcpd or no no GCFD, Gotham City Fire Department. I tiled that road up over there. And the car can come out. It's on the water because it's kind of where it's based. Here's Gotham Beach. I put all the beach-related stuff over there. Like that little lifeguard thing from the starter set. That's also from the same set. 
There's that thing, that thing, and that thing, which are from the same set. The tree is there because I haven't decided to move it. And that is there because I haven't decided to move it either. It's kind of, I don't know, messy. There's some people just talking. You have some sharks attacking a man because Aquaman is angry at him for having the same hair type as him. Yeah. Here's Gotham Energy Facility. I just com kind of combined them all into one set and then fenced them off with those pieces. Um, there's an old Lego McDonald's set. I don't know. I just had it and I was like, well, it's a McDonald's, so why not build a McDonald's? I mean, like, you're trying to make it look as real as possible and like the real world, then. Like a McDonald's. They're everywhere. <laughs> Here's a dumpster based off of the ones in DC Super Villains. This is the little fire area that came from the fire station. Here is Gotham City Docks and Terminal. I took the Terminal set. And I'm going to order a half size dark blue, dark blue scrape base plate. And a full size and place them right there. I'm probably not going to tile them, but I wanted to. I was going to take those large 8x16 um, tiles that are dark blue gray, but Lego doesn't have them because they're all sorted out of them. So I'm just going to take the base plates. I'm planning to make a garage for this thing. Just the, the designer I'm trying to design it in is not respecting its own laws, so it's kind of annoying. So yeah, it's, this is here. You can see these little things come off. I want to make a new boat. I just kind of wasted all the pieces on that. Or I forget which, but whatever it is. Or it was that. I wasted, There was a little section here that people could dock into, but I didn't really feel like finding pieces. So I just took it from that, put it on there, on the apartment right there here's death stroke and anarchy some criminals with an ice gun this little buoy um gun or missiles i'm not sure what they're supposed to be because they look like buoys but they're missiles so if you're trying to shoot plastic at a bat boat it doesn't make sense you can see all of this stuff is tiled. It's a little phone booth. But yeah, it's a pretty large city and there's always more to come. So, oh, this is a little, um, I don't know, appliance store that my brother made because we had so many like Lego friends appliances that it was pointless not to put them into one store so we just decided to put them there i have the exclusive uh superman lex luthor power suit so i just put all those guys on this because it's easy to find them so yeah uh thank you guys for watching uh, if you want to see more just comment down below see you in the next video